Right before walking out, I received a piece of advice from someone that shall not be named. He's bald and standing to my left, and his name is John Griffin. He, he said there's three rings in life. Engagement ring, wedding ring, and suffering. <laughs> Kim tells me, Tori's bringing a boy home. Are you nervous? And I'm, I'm not nervous. Why would I be nervous? I nervous. <laughs> I remember they got in late. It was about 11 o'clock at night. And Neil walked in the door. He looks right at me with big old eyes and a smile on his face and he reaches out for me. And he nailed it, he did. He nailed it, he got me eye contact and a good handshake. And I knew right then, I'm like, this kid's got some promise. There's no doubt about it. Neil, I feel like I watched you love her from the moment you came into her life. I feel like I saw the way you looked at her, appreciated her, and understood her. You allowed her to feel seen and heard, and I feel like you are each other's both selves when you're together. Neil and Tori's relationship was a no-brainer from the start. It was never, you know, if they're gonna get married, but when they're gonna get married. Um, I've never seen two people more compatible for each other. I knew you were gonna grab my ass. I feel like a lot of people start their vows by saying, I can't believe this day is finally here, but I sure can. <laughs> Over 10 years together, a handful of moves across a couple states, two dogs, and a pandemic later, I'm so glad to say this day has finally come. We have been through a lot together, many ups and downs, but I can't imagine doing life with anyone else. You make me laugh every day. You've become my problem solver, my confidant, my number one hype man, and the best damn cook around for sure. You are so passionate about everything you do. You go all in all the time. I promise to always put you first and remind you how much I love you. I'm so privileged to have not only been able to grow up with you, but to grow old with you too. And I can't wait for many more years to come. Tori, though meeting at the Arizona State on your run, is not exactly the most romantic or serendipitous setting. We shared a moment that is forever etched in my heart. Today marks 4,039 days since we first met. And in that time, you become my best friend, my foundation, and above all, you become home. The days to come are inherently uncertain, but of these two things I know, that I would not be the man I am today without you, and that we can endure anything as long as we're together. I love you because... <laughs> I love you because consideration of others is at the cornerstone of your being. I love you because you make me a better person. It has been 4,039 days since we first met, and I'm so excited that's just the beginning. I love you. is a journey and sometimes not easy but it all ends well for a couple of breezies to the game stay true pimp love forever boo <laughs> Neil and Tori I love you guys I can't wait to school you on the dance floor here in a few hours
Cheers to the bride and groom.